The water buck is built for lakes and marshlands of Arusha. These are hefty antelope with a distinctive white ring around the rump. They can often be detected by the musky scent that is given off by their oily hair. Unlike many other hoofed animals, they live in mixed herds with multiple males and females. As we head west from the lakes, we enter our fourth area of the park. We've already seen the Little Serengeti, the forest, and the lakes. That brings us to the crater zone. The whole park owes its diversity to violent volcanic eruptions. The aftermath of those eruptions can be seen in what is today's craters and valleys. The craters and their valleys help create the lakes and the magnificent forests for the park's big game to inhabit. The very existence of the forest is due to the mineral-rich soil created from volcanic ash. The scenery is absolutely awesome. 